هلو جايز ازيكم عاملين ايه يا رب تكونوا كويسين بنكلم مع بعض كورس التقوية وتحسين الاستماع في اللغة الانجليزية مهارة الاستماع في اللغة الانجليزية طبعا الكورس ده دي المحاضرة التالتة في الكورس كلم مع بعض يونت 3 طبعا دي extended family بتكلم عن دي extended family يعني ايه extended family يعني العيلة الكبيرة العيلة كلها بقى تمام من اول ال parents أو grandparents من أول الأجداد لحد عماتك خالاتك أي حد طبعا تبع العائلة يعني أوكي دي اسمها extended family لأن يعني طبعا الأسرة دي العائلة العائلة الكبيرة لأن الأسرة طبعا الأسرة مثلا مكونة من الأب والأم والأخوات أو الأخوات بتتسمى nuclear family فهذه extended family وفي nuclear family فطبعا في اليونت ديت هن آه طبعا هنسمع كل المحادثات اللي فيها والفوكابولري اوكي ففي يونت 3 كلها مشروحه طبعا في كورس الجامعه الامريكيه على تو سيشنز اوكي طبعا كشرح بالتفصيل ولكن طبعا احنا هنا بنركز في الكورس ده على الاستماع اوكي والكونفرسيشنز والفوكابولري والبرونسيشن والنطق الصحيح تمام واللي انت بتسمعه من السبيكرز اوكي فده طبعا ده اللي احنا بنشتغل عليه في الكورس ده فعندنا اول حاجه الفوكابولري بتاعت اللي اكستندد فاميلي كل ايه المسميات بتاعت العائله فتعال نسمعها كده page 26 exercise b vocabulary the extended family listen and repeat in the pauses grandparents grandfather grandmother uncle aunt cousins parents mother father in-laws mother-in-law father-in-law sister-in-law brother nephew niece sister husband children son daughter brother-in-law فدي كل العائل اسمعها تاني page 26 exercise b vocabulary the extended family listen and repeat in the pauses grandparents grandfather grandmother uncle aunt cousins parents mother father in-laws mother-in-law father-in-law sister-in-law brother nephew niece sister husband children son daughter brother-in-law طبعا التكرار يا جماعه في الكورس ده مهم جدا 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 ان تتكرر الكلمات الفوكابولري المحادثات اوكي لان طبعا دي اهم حاجه في الكورس ده اوكي ان انت تسمع كتير وتكرر كتير وان سبيكر عشان pronunciation بتاعك والاكسنت بتاعتك تبقى كويسه امريكان اكسنت اوكي طيب عندنا هنا فور ستوري ريد ا ليسن تو تو ومن ديسكاسن فاميلي فوتوز اوكي فطبعا نسمع انا اند جين بي ديسكرايب ا الفاميلي طبعا ودي شرحنا برده كل الشرح والتفصيل او اسمها شرح تفصيل كورس الجامعة الأمريكية موجود على اليوتيوب موجود في الديسكربشن اوكي فتقدر تسمعه طبعا في أي وقت قائمة التشغيل بالترتيب موجودة تسمع الكورس بالكامل كشرح عشان طبعا 
عاوز لو عاوز بقى طبعا تماستر الامريكان اكسنت وتبقى متحدث انجلش كويس اوكي طبعا لايك انا انجلش ليرنر ان انجلش سبيكر اوكي اف يو وان تو سبيك انجلش فيري جود يو هاف تو ليرن فروم ذا بيست ده طبعا افضل ذا بيست كورس اون ذا بلانت اوكي ده افضل كورس على الكوكب بجد يعني حقيقي جدا لان الكورس ده افاد كتير ناس كتير جدا جدا وتعلمت منه كتير جدا جدا فطبعا هيفيدك جدا جدا لو انت بتبدا خاصه لو انت بتبدا من الاول ما تعرفش حاجه عن الانجليش خالص فبتبدا من الاول فالكورس ده هيأسسك تاسيس كويس جدا في الامريكان انجليش وخاصه طبعا كورس الصوتيات وبعد كده كورس جامعه امريكان اللي هو الكورس ده اللي احنا بناخد منه الاستماع حاليا وشغالين عليه وكورس شورت ستوريز طبعا موجود برضو كورس مهم جدا 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 اوكي فدي خطه الدراسه بالترتيب طبعا هتلاقيها في صندوق الوصف لو عاوز تبدا من الاول اوكي وعاوز تشوف شرح الكورس ده وشرح المحادثات بالتفصيل فهتلاقيها طبعا موجوده فيلا بينا نسمع المحادثه دي page 27 exercise d photo story read and listen to two women discussing family photos who's that guy your brother No, that's my brother-in-law, David. He's married to my older sister, Laura. And this is their son, Michael. He's adopted. Do they have any other children? Just the one. He's an only child. Looks like they're having a great time in New York. Actually, they live there. They do? Wow. How often do you see them? About twice a year. And what about these kids? They're my younger sisters. Vicky's the girl, and these are her little brothers, Nick and Alex. Nick and Alex look so much alike. Are they twins? They are. My sister and her kids all live in Hong Kong. كده طبعا سمعنا المحادثه طبعا الكلمات الصعبه او الكلمات اللي عليها هنا موجوده ايه adopted means David and Laura are in Michael's birth parents. Okay, يعني متبنى طفل متبنى. Twins means Nick and Alex were born at the same time. يعني twins يعني توأم. هما ولدهم في نفس او اتولدوا في نفس الوقت اوكي فنسمع المحادثه تاني ويريد تكرر الجمل وراهم ورن سبيكر اوكي توقف وتكرر ورن سبيكر page 27 exercise d photo story read and listen to two women discussing family photos who's that guy your brother No, that's my brother-in-law, David. He's married to my older sister, Laura, and this is their son, Michael. He's adopted. Do they have any other children? Just the one. He's an only child. Looks like they're having a great time in New York. Actually, they live there. They do? Wow. How often do you see them? About twice a year. And what about these kids? They're my younger sisters. Vicky's the girl, and these are her little brothers, Nick and Alex. Nick and Alex look so much alike. Are they twins? They are. Type them, guys. So let's move on to the next thing, the next lesson, which is lesson one. Report news about relationships, relationships and marital status. حالة الاجتماعية طبعا والعلاقات. فنشوف الحالة الاجتماعية بقى هنا في كلمات. Okay. فتعال بينا نسمعها. Alright, بين the couples. فتعال نشوف. Page 28. Vocabulary. Relationships and marital status. Exercise A. Read and listen. They're single. They're engaged. He's her fiancé. She's his fiancé. They're married. They're separated. They're divorced. He's her ex-husband. She's his ex-wife. She's widowed. Now listen again and repeat in the pauses. They're single. They're engaged. He's her fiance. She's his fiance. They're married. They're separated. They're divorced. He's her ex-husband. She's his ex-wife. She's widowed. تمام guys. 
هي تكون بتكرر طبعا ال pronunciation ورن speaker a lot كمان عشان تطلعه كويس ولما تيجي تتكلم يبقى ال accent بتاعتك كويس طيب ده طبعا listening listening comprehension ف listen to the conversations circle the word that accomplishes each statement ف four conversations هنا عندنا كل واحد بيتكلم عن الشخص يعني اللي موجود اوكي وهنشوف بقى هنكمل الجمل ديت اوكي فاسمع كويس عشان تشوف الحل بتاعك صح ولا غلط يلا بينا page 28 exercise b listening comprehension listen to the conversations circle the word that completes each statement conversation 1 who are these people in the picture that older couple those are my in-laws of course they look just like larry yeah they do conversation two these two are a cute couple who are they that's my aunt and that's her ex-husband her ex-husband yeah they're not married anymore conversation three is that your sister yes it is and who's that guy her husband not yet that's her fiance oh how nice Conversation four. Who's that in this picture? That's my sister and her husband. Nice looking couple. They were a nice looking couple. They're thinking about getting divorced. That's too bad. Yeah, she's living with my parents right now. Okay, guys. So, أول حاجة the woman is married. إبا أول حاجة is married. The first conversation. Second in conversation, his aunt is divorced. Okay, divorced. E D ending. خلي بالك منا divorced. في هنا a voice sound. لو ال C. فهنا to pronounce T. E D to pronounce A T. Divorced. Okay. Three. His sister is engaged. رقم ثلاثة engaged. Okay. مكتوبة. Her sister is separated. They're getting, they're thinking about divorce. Okay, so his sister, her sister is separated. Mumfasulinia. Okay. Fa yalla bina isma tani conversation kulla ashen tisbat fid Page 28. Exercise B. Listening comprehension. Listen to the conversations. Circle the word that completes each statement. Conversation 1. Who are these people in the picture? That older couple? Those are my in-laws. Of course. They look just like Larry. Yeah, they do. Conversation 2. These two are a cute couple. Who are they? That's my aunt. And that's her ex-husband. Her ex-husband? Yeah, they're not married anymore. Conversation 3. Is that your sister? Yes, it is. And who's that guy? Her husband? Not yet. That's her fiance. Oh, how nice. Conversation four. Who's that in this picture? That's my sister and her husband. Nice looking couple. They were a nice looking couple. They're thinking about getting divorced. That's too bad. Yeah, she's living with my parents right now. Okay, guys, so let's move on to the next thing, which is a conversation model. Read and listen to good news about a relationship. The good news and bad news, okay? Let's listen to this conversation. Page 29. Conversation model. Exercise A. Read and listen to good news about a relationship. What's new? Actually, I have some good news. My sister just got engaged. That's great. Congratulations. Thanks. So, tell me about her fiancé. Well, he works at PBM. He's an engineer. Or bad news. Actually, I have some bad news. My sister just got divorced. I'm sorry to hear that. Is she okay? Yes, she is. Thanks for asking. 
okay guys so what's new الاخبار actually i have some good news اما تبع عندك some good news طبعا تقول i have some good news او استمر حد بحاجه كويسه i have some good news my sister just got engaged في good news دي that's great congratulations بركت لها thanks so tell me about her fiance well he works at pbm as an engineer لو عندك bad news بقى خبر وحش او استمر حد But I have some bad news. My sister just got divorced. I'm sorry to hear that. But show empathy. But all, I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, the too bad. Okay. Is she okay? Yes, she is. Thanks for asking. Okay. But that's my bad. Wait, Karar, gumla gumla wara in need speaker. Okay. Page twenty nine, exercise B, rhythm and intonation. Listen again and repeat in the pauses. Then practice the conversation model with a partner. What's new? Actually, I have some good news. My sister just got engaged. That's great. Congratulations. Thanks. So, Tell me about her fiance. Well, he works at PBM. He's an engineer. Actually, I have some bad news. My sister just got divorced. I'm sorry to hear that. Is she okay? Yes, she is. Thanks for asking. Lesson number two: Describe extended families. Okay. Find then any other family relationships. All right, other family relationships. Uh, for this, of course, the things that the what is the thing? We have stepfather, stepmother, stepfather. Yani his wife's mom. My, he's my mother's second husband. Gina is my stepmother. She's my father's second wife. My little ab. Okay, uh, Jim is my stepbrother. His mother married my father. فأخوها طبعا step brother أخوها الغير شقيق. Kyla is my step sister. All right. Type Carl is my step son. نفس الحكاية married his father three years ago. Right. So this Tina is my step daughter. I married her mother when Tina was five. Dana is my half sister. We have the same mother but different fathers. وبرضو لو half brothers and half sisters can also have the same father but different mothers يعني أب واحد بس الأمهات مختلفة أو أم واحدة بس الأبهات مختلفين okay Rob's uh, my half brother فطبعا أوديو حيقول كلمات اللي هي بالأزرع دي okay كلمات اللي هي family relationships alright وهي حتكررها وراه page 30 vocabulary other family relationships Exercise A. Read and listen. Stepfather. Stepmother. Stepbrother. Stepsister. Stepson. Stepdaughter. Half sister. Half brother. Now listen again and repeat in the pauses. Stepfather. Stepmother. Stepbrother. Stepsister. Stepson. Stepdaughter. Half sister. Half brother. Okay, guys. Find a vocabulary that know how. Alright, let's move on to the listening comprehension. Okay. طبعا على الايه الكلمات اللي احنا استخدمناها رايت right? عشان برضو تستوعبها اكتر سو ليسن تو ذا سبيكرز اند انفر ذا ريليشن شيبس طبعا هتكمل هنا ب ريليشن شيبس اللي فوق دي يوت فوكابولري تو كومبليت ايش ستيتمنت على الفوكابولري اللي احنا استخدمناها ليسن اجين اف نيسيساري اوكي تعال نشوف فايف كونفرسيشنز اهم وهنكمل طبعا الايه بالكلمات اللي فوق دي فركز في الليسننج ده Page 30. Exercise C. Listening comprehension. 
Listen to the speakers and infer the relationships. Use the vocabulary to complete each statement. Listen again if necessary. Speaker 1. Well, after a few years, my brother finally got married again. His new wife is really nice. She has three daughters, and I know he loves them a lot. Speaker 2. Carol and I are very close. Her mom married my dad when I was about seven, so we really grew up together. Speaker 3. My parents got divorced when I was only three. After a few years, my father married again. We don't live together, but I call his new wife mom. Speaker 4. Leo's a great kid. I'm really glad I married his mother. The three of us are really happy together. Speaker 5. Hank and I have the same father. My mom is his stepmother. His mother is my father's ex-wife. Okay, Her brother has three step daughters. Okay, three step daughters. All right. Number two, Carol is his stepsister. Right, step sister. Uh, three, she calls her her Eva stepmother, mother or mom. Okay, so she calls her stepmother because she got close and she's very nice, so she calls her mom. Leo is his stepson, step a son. Hank is her half brother. Okay, but Hank is her or half brother. Okay, طيب. Let's listen again to the whole conversations, guys, in order to stick in your mind. Page 30. Exercise C. Listening Comprehension. Listen to the speakers and infer the relationships. Use the vocabulary to complete each statement. Listen again if necessary. Speaker 1. Well, after a few years, my brother finally got married again. His new wife is really nice. She has three daughters, and I know he loves them a lot. Speaker 2 Carol and I are very close. Her mom married my dad when I was about seven, so we really grew up together. Speaker 3 My parents got divorced when I was only three. After a few years, my father married again. We don't live together, but I call his new wife mom. Speaker 4 Leo's a great kid. I'm really glad I married his mother. The three of us are really happy together. Speaker 5 Hank and I have the same father. My mom is his stepmother. His mother is my father's ex-wife. Okay, guys. Type. So, we have vocabulary. We have practice. We have listening comprehension. Type. Let's move on to another thing. Type. On. It does not talk about a describing the family. Okay, describing how to describe your family. Find a few conversation model. Listen to people describing their families. Okay. Type. Let's listen to this conversation. Page thirty-one. Conversation model. Exercise A. Read and listen to people describing their families. Do you come from a large family? Not really. I have two brothers. What about aunts and uncles? Well, I have three aunts on my father's side. And on my mother's side, I have two aunts and three uncles. That's pretty big. I know what it want. It's mouth color where I need a speaker. Page 31. Exercise B. Rhythm and intonation. Listen again and repeat in the pauses. Then practice the conversation model with a partner. Do you come from a large family? Not really. I have two brothers. What about aunts and uncles? 
Well, I have three aunts on my father's side, and on my mother's side, I have two aunts and three uncles. That's pretty big. Type time. Want to converse your model? Okay, so let's move on to the other lesson, which is lesson number three. Compare people. How to compare people to Karim Bain al Ashkos? Zay. Find in a vocabulary similarities and differences. Okay. Zay tashabu lechtalaf bain al Ashkos. Taban zay e nuulu au nishrah ehna shabah baad au muhtalifiyan baad zay. Find in a taban audio vocabulary. So let's listen to it. Page 32. Before you listen. Exercise A. Vocabulary. Similarities and differences. Read and listen. How are you alike? We look alike. We look the same. We wear similar clothes. We like the same kind of clothes. We both like rock music. Both of us like rock music. How are you different? We don't look alike. We look different. We wear different clothes. We like different clothes. I like rock music, but he likes classical. I like rock music, but he doesn't. Now listen again and repeat in the pauses. We look alike. We look the same. We wear similar clothes. We like the same kind of clothes. We both like rock music. Both of us like rock music. We don't look alike. We look different. We wear different clothes. We like different clothes. I like rock music, but he likes classical. I like rock music, but he doesn't. Okay, guys. So... I want to match when clothes, okay? Clothes, guys, or clothes. My fashion clothes, it's wrong, totally wrong. Wrong pronunciation, okay? T H, Radia S, O E S, Fa, Ben Ul, clothes or clothes. They month and months, okay? Now, come on, one month. It's a lot of sanctuary, T H, Radi. One or two months, now come on, two months, but one month, but T H, to be silent. Okay, you have to pronounce it as best. Okay, from first two months, while I close this, because wrong. Okay, from smart, a right pronunciation, men and his speaker. Okay, for that, it's very important. Because of that, listening is very important. Listening is the key to help you speak English very well and speak English better. Okay. فطبعا لازم تسمع كتير عشان pronunciation او speaking بتاعك يبقى كويس في الانجليش او في اي لغة طيب listen and comprehension identify similarities and differences listen to Lucille Kennedy Lucille Kennedy talk about herself and her sister Laura check the statements that are true explain your answers شايفين Lucille Kennedy استديت هتتكلم عنها وعن اختها لورا فتشوف بعد differences with similarities the you know, do they look? Do they look alike? Do you, do they look different? Do they like the same food? Like different food? Uh, like the same kind of movies? Different kinds of movies? But too bad. Difference with similarities. We had back. Lucille and Laura are too bad twins. Well, step sisters. Well, half sisters. A relation between home. Okay, family relation. فتعال بينا يلا نسمع ورا ولا معاك عشان تحدد تمام و او تخزن في دماغك الاجابات عشان لما طبعا اجي اقولها تشوفها صح ولا غلط و الاندرستاند بتاعك كام في الميه من اللسن اللي انت بتسمعه 
لو لقيته عشرين او تلاتين في المية يبقى انت لسه محتاج تسمع كتير تسمع اكتر تراجع على الحاجات اللي قبل كده اوريت والفيديوهات اللي قبل كده عشان الليسنين بتاعك يتطور لو تسمع ستين سبعين في المية فده كويس يبقى انت ان انترميديت ليفل اوكي لو في ادفانس ليفل بقى وفاهم كل حاجة فانت محتاج طبعا المستويات المتقدمة فلسه طبعا ممكن ت... يعني تسمع معانا لحد ما ايه توصل للمستويات المتقدمة وطبعا تشوف بقى موفيز و بدون انجلش سبتايدل او مسلسلات بتو... بدون انجلش سبتايدل لو وصلت المرحلة دي يبقى انت كده خلاص ان ا جود ليفل تمام وتبدا بقى ايه تقرا كتب او تقرا روايات بالانجلش او تشوف حاجة طبعا المجال اللي انت فيه وتكمل فيه او الحاجة اللي انت بتحبها وتكمل فيها طيب لسن كومبرينشن فتعالى بينا يلا نسمع الاوديو ونشوف بقى ال differences with similarities بينها وبين اختها بين لوسيل وبين لورا page 32 Listening comprehension. Exercise A. Identify similarities and differences. Listen to Lucille Kennedy talk about herself and her sister Laura. Check the statements that are true. Explain your answers. We're talking today with Lucille Kennedy, who comes from a family of three kids. And Lucille, I hear you have a younger brother. Right. Five years younger. And a sister. That's right. And you and your sister are twins, is that right? Right. She was born eight minutes before me. I was the little one. <laughs> well, tell us a little bit about your sister. What's her name, by the way? Her name's Laura. Laura? So, Lucille, do you both look alike? We do, actually. A lot of people can't tell us apart. Really? But I wear glasses all the time. She only wears them for reading. I see. Some people say twins like the same things. Is that true for you two? Well, we both love Mexican food. We always have the same thing when we go to restaurants. And let's see. We like the same kinds of movies. Anything else? Well, this is kind of funny. Sometimes we each buy almost the same clothes. Not because we want to, it just happens by accident. I go to visit her and she's wearing the same shirt I am. It's always a surprise. So how are you different from each other? Well, Laura's a great dancer. And me, I can't dance at all. Anything else? Let's see. Her favorite color is green, mine's blue. She loves football, and I love baseball. <laughs> I could go on and on. Well, how about musical tastes? Oh, yeah. I love classical music, but she really prefers pop. I actually play the piano, but she doesn't play any musical instrument. I'd say she's really more of a dancer than a musical person. And how about your own marriages and families? Are they similar in any way? Well, we both have two kids. I've got a boy and a girl. She's got two boys. But our husbands are completely different. <laughs> Not at all alike. Really? Well, thank you, Lucille Kennedy, for talking with us today about you and your twin sister. Thank you. That was fun. Okay, guys. Ma'am, عندنا هنا بقى موجود يبقى Lucille and Laura. ايه ال similarities اللي بينهم؟ they look alike because لأن هما طبعا رقم سبعة Lucille and Laura are twins okay فهما twins ف they look alike right people cannot you know tear them apart or cannot you know compare them like the same food they like the same food number two like the same or number three like the same kinds of movies as well number four sometimes wear the same clothes all right and just happens by accident that's a bit so far but like in home of the one be sure i'll be able to nafs ellipse ahiyanan khamsa like different music like different music all right way number six have the same number of kids all right also uh they have two kids all right both of them so uh they have the same number of kids from what i think best three types of music طيب let's move on to the other thing and then I listen again to the same thing Lucille and uh, Laura okay but Lucille says about these topics what Lucille says 
about these types of favorite colors, musical tastes, sports preferences, families. فتقدر بقى طبعا تلقط أي حاجة من الحاجات دي بتقول عليها. Okay. Use the vocabulary to write sentences about how she and her sister are different. For example, they like different colors. So she likes Kaza, where Laura likes Kaza. Page 33. Exercise B. Listen to take notes. Listen again for what Lucille says about these topics. On your notepad, use the vocabulary to write sentences about how she and her sister are different. We're talking today with Lucille Kennedy, who comes from a family of three kids. And Lucille, I hear you have a younger brother. Right. Five years younger. And a sister. That's right. And you and your sister are twins, is that right? Right. She was born eight minutes before me. I was the little one. <laughs> well, tell us a little bit about your sister. What's her name, by the way? Her name's Laura. Laura? So, Lucille, do you both look alike? We do, actually. A lot of people can't tell us apart. Really? But I wear glasses all the time. She only wears them for reading. I see. Some people say twins like the same things. Is that true for you two? Well, we both love Mexican food. We always have the same thing when we go to restaurants. And let's see, we like the same kinds of movies. Anything else? Well, this is kind of funny. Sometimes we each buy almost the same clothes. Not because we want to, it just happens by accident. I go to visit her and she's wearing the same shirt I am. It's always a surprise. So, how are you different from each other? Well, Laura's a great dancer. And me? I can't dance at all. Anything else? Let's see. Her favorite color is green, mine's blue. She loves football and I love baseball. <laughs> I could go on and on. Well, how about musical tastes? Oh yeah, I love classical music, but she really prefers pop. I actually play the piano, but she doesn't play any musical instrument. I'd say she's really more of a dancer than a musical person. And how about your own marriages and families? Are they similar in any way? Well, we both have two kids. I've got a boy and a girl. She's got two boys. But our husbands are completely different. <laughs> Not at all alike. Really? Well, thank you, Lucille Kennedy, for talking with us today about you and your twin sister. Thank you. That was fun. Okay, guys. فطبعاً يريد تكون طلعت طبعاً أو كتبت الحاجات اللي هما مختلفين فيها أو اللي هما بيحبوها أو مفضلين. Favorite colors. All right. So they like different colors. Lucille likes blue. Okay. And uh, Laura prefers red. Musical tastes. Uh, to come on classical for Lucille and Laura likes pop okay pop music and uh, also uh, Lucille plays the piano okay but uh, Laura doesn't play any instrument musical instrument sports preferences okay so she likes different sports families uh, Lucille has a boy and a girl and Laura has two boys okay and one the husbands uh, are different okay طيب عندنا blended sounds يعني ايه blended sounds well like pay attention to the blended sounds in does she and he uh, does he then listen again and repeat I mean, the one does she I mean, does she does she do that or does she work here لما نيجي نسأل السؤال كده فمنقول does she does she الاس بلندن يعني ايه ادغام اوكي بندغم الاس في الشاه ساوند فما بنسمعش الاس بنسمع الشاه ساوند على طول تسهيله للنطق فبنقول is she okay does she work here or does she work there alright بنقول does he الضمائر طبعا بنعملها ريدكشن فقدناها في كورس الفوناتكس الصوتيات uh, does he فبنقول does he does he live near you اوكي فطبعا هتسمع ال pronunciation من ال speaker واحد كارل وراء سؤال نقول هنا does she have any stepchildren does she have any stepchildren 
How many stepchildren does she have? Does she have? من قلش does she have كده لا Does she have على طول Alright Does she have طيب من قلش does he من قلش does he live near you? Does he live near you? فال H ما بتسمعهاش بتبقى blend sound فمن قلش does he Okay فحطها كتب لك فوق بين uh, transcription يعني Does he Does he Does he live near you? Where does he live? Where does he live? Okay so let's listen to the audio. Page 33. Pronunciation. Blending sounds. Exercise A. Read and listen. Pay attention to the blended sounds in does she and does he. One. Does she have any stepchildren? Two. How many stepchildren does she have? Three. Does he live near you? Four. Where does he live? Now listen again and repeat in the pauses. Does she have any stepchildren? How many stepchildren does she have? Does he live near you? Where does he live? Okay, guys. طبعا مهم جدا جدا في فناتكس عشان تسهل نفسك النوت أو تفهم النت سبيكر وهو بيتكلم سرعة. Okay. All right. So be sure to recycle this language. فخدنا طبعا similarities and differences. لما نقول عاوز نشوف how are you alike? How are you different? Do you look alike? Do you both like the same kind of music? Uh, do you like the same kind of food, kind of movies? Uh, for more information, how about your husband? How about your wife? How about your children? Do you have any kids? Do you have any, you know, any kind of uh, clothes that you like? How old? What does your husband do what does your sister do what does your brother do uh, where does your aunts live uh, your grandparents live or okay, how many kids how many children do your brother have okay type lesson number four discuss family cultural traditions all right يعني حناقش الثقافات او التقاليد الثقافية للعائلة فعندنا هنا reading طبعا خدناه بالتفصيل اوكي كل الحاجات دي مشروحة في كورس الجامعة الأمريكية لو عاوز تسمعها موجودة كورس بترتيب على اليوتيوب في قائمة التشغيل ولكن احنا طبعا هنا هنتكلم عن cultural traditions for the families فأنا طبعا القطعة ديت كانت بتلخص عن when adult children come home لما تتكلم عن adult children أطفال بالغين يعني طبعا شباب 18 سنة عارفين طبعا في أمريكا uh, most Americans يعني طبعا الأطفال لما الطفل يوصل ل 18 سنة أو البنت يوصل ل 18 سنة بينتقلوا من البيت لما من العيشة يعني مع والديهم وبيروحوا كمان طبعا إيه بيعيشوا حياتهم أو يعتمدوا على نفسهم أوكي فطبعا السؤال هنا في شخص يعني سأل Mr. Dad to ask Mr. Dad Armin Brat Below my wife and I recently sent our last child off to college We are ready to sell the house and travel But our oldest daughter doesn't have a job and plans to move back home What should we do? فالسؤال طبعا هو مراته مؤخرا أرسلوا آخر طفل عندهم للكلية تمام فخلاص هما مفاضهم بقى ما رمشوا حاجة We are ready to sell the house and travel هيبيع البيت وحيسافر ولكن في مشكلة ان بنتهم الكبيرة ما عندهاش شغل انا مش لاقي وظيفة ومخططة انها ترجع تاني البيت عندهم وتقعد معاهم فهو مش عارف يعمل ايه فبيسأله what should we do فهيجاوبه طبعا يبقى طويلة شوية فهيشوف الثقافة عندهم بتقول ايه وبعد كده هقوله بالنسبة لك انت ممكن تعمل كذا وكذا وكذا اللي هما التلات تلات نقط دول فتعالى بينا نسمع ال conversation او reading ده من الاوديو alright it's very easy طبعا عاوز تشوف الشرح هتلاقيه في كورس آه الجامعة الأمريكية طبعا بالشرح بالتفصيل في السيشن بتاعتها اوكي السيشن بتاعت الوحدة دي extended families the extended families لا number three and four مشروحين مع بعض اوكي تعالى 
pipe. Let's listen to it, guys. Page 34. Reading. Read and listen. When adult children come home. My wife and I recently sent our last child off to college. We are ready to sell the house and travel. But our oldest daughter doesn't have a job and plans to move back home. What should we do? Most North Americans expect their children to move out of the house at 18. But that's changing. Today, more adult children are returning home to live. Some don't have jobs or can't pay for the high costs of housing. Some are recently separated or divorced. Most are single, but some come home with a wife, husband, or child, too. Most parents are happy when their kids come back home to live. However, when a son or daughter can't find a job or is recently divorced, there can be problems. And if their son or daughter is still at home at the age of 35, many parents are no longer happy. In your case, what if your daughter moves back home? Don't worry. If you and your daughter had a good relationship when she was younger, she'll be fine. Help her in any way you can. And it's okay to ask, how long do you plan on staying? Don't treat your daughter like a child. In our culture, adult children don't feel good about living at home, and they don't want to depend on their parents' help. Tell her you understand. Talk to your daughter as an adult. Have a discussion about paying for expenses and helping with household responsibilities and chores, such as kitchen cleanup and doing laundry. If you and your daughter talk and try to understand each other, everyone will be happier. Okay, guys. سمعناها طبعا reading فطبعا مهم جدا جدا نسمعها كتير كتير جدا اوكي فمهم جدا ان انت تسمع وتكرر الليسننج تسمعها اكتر من مرة اوكي كل طبعا الحاجات اللي احنا خدناها مع الحاجات اللي احنا بناخدها ونواصل في اخدها اوكي فطبعا دي حاجات على الوحدة اللي طبعا براكتس ديت كلها مشروحة في او اوريدي شرحتها قبل كده وحلينا الاسئلة دي قبل كده في الكورس اوكي احنا طبعا بركز هنا على الليسننج اكتر اوكي اهم حاجة الليسننج هنا طيب عندنا هنا الليسننج كومبرينشن ريفيو بتاع الوحدة اوكي دي اخر حاجة في الوحدة واخر حاجة في سيشن النهاردة ان شاء الله uh, listen and comprehension. Listen to the people talking about their families. Check the box of a family size for each speaker. The listen again and write the number of children in each person's family. So, uh, and then four people talking about their families. Fanchuf, بالنسبة لكل شخص, a big family, whether it's a big family or a small family, one number of children in the family. Okay? Type, let's listen to the audio. Page 36. Review. Exercise A. Listening Comprehension. Listen to the people talking about their families. Check the box for family size for each speaker. Speaker 1. My name's Brenda. My parents, George and Nancy McCann, live in Houston. My father's an engineer and my mom's a homemaker. I'm actually an only child, so when I was a kid, I sometimes really wanted to have lots of brothers and sisters. But I was pretty lucky. I had lots of friends, and my parents loved me. So it was okay. And now I'm an engineer like my dad. Speaker 2. You want my name first? Okay, Stephen Bartmeyer. I'm 22. Let's see. Well, uh, growing up, I actually always wanted to be an only child. It was sometimes a little crowded around the house with seven brothers and sisters. I'm the baby in the family, but my mom and dad were great. Speaker 3. Leslie Green here. You want to hear about my family? Okay, let me think. Well, there's a... Sorry, there's a bunch of us. Maya, Ricky, and me, I'm in the middle. Walter, Sandra... And Andrew. There, that's everyone. But you know something? We have a lot of fun. We're a happy family. Speaker 4. Hi, I'm Jason, Jason Sanders. I have a younger brother, Gus. That's it. He's a manager over at PBM. Actually, he lives in Vancouver now, so I don't see him very much. What else? Um, well, my father's retired. He stopped working two years ago. And my mom, she still works. 
She's a professor. Now listen again and write the number of children in each person's family. Speaker 1. My name's Brenda. My parents, George and Nancy McCann, live in Houston. My father's an engineer and my mom's a homemaker. I'm actually an only child, so when I was a kid I sometimes really wanted to have lots of brothers and sisters. But I was pretty lucky. I had lots of friends, and my parents loved me. So it was okay, and now I'm an engineer like my dad. Speaker 2. You want my name first? Okay, Stephen Bartmeyer. I'm 22. Let's see. Uh, well, uh, growing up, I actually always wanted to be an only child. It was sometimes a little crowded around the house with seven brothers and sisters. I'm the baby in the family, but my mom and dad were great. Speaker 3. Leslie Green here. You want to hear about my family? Okay, let me think. Well, there's a... Sorry, there's a bunch of us. Maya, Ricky, and me, I'm in the middle. Walter, Sandra, and Andrew. There, that's everyone. But you know something? We have a lot of fun. We're a happy family. Speaker 4. Hi, I'm Jason. Jason Sanders. I have a younger brother, Gus. That's it. He's a manager over at PBM. Actually, he lives in Vancouver now, so I don't see him very much. What else? Um, well, my father's retired. He stopped working two years ago. And my mom, she still works. She's a professor. عرفنا كده سمعنا المحادثة مرتين. Okay, فطبعا مفروض الاكسرسايز يبقى سهل. عندنا أول حاجة Brenda. It's a small family. Okay, just her parents. And the number of children, just only child. Brenda is an only child, family number of children, one. Okay, just one. Only child. Stephen. Stephen, it's a pretty big family. Okay, Leila لأنه عندهم عنده uh, Stephen عنده seven brothers and sisters and a baby in the family, so it's eight. Well, who I nine? Nine children. Okay, Leslie, it's a big family as well, and no matter six. Six children in the family. Jason, he has only just a younger brother, so he Taman it's a small family with him two. Okay, two children in the family. Okay, so I think that's it, guys. Taman Hagadi Kula Halinaha fi Taman el Kosi Gamma Rekat, like Kula Hagam Shuha Kula Hagam Hula, but Tafseel, okay, with Sharp Hibit Tafseel Taman the Ness and Beginners. اوكي ف طبعا لو عاوز تسمع او تبدا الكورس من الاول هتلاقيه كله موجود فوق في الديسكربشن اوكي وطبعا القائمه الشغل كلها موجوده على اليوتيوب بالترتيب فهنا طبعا تعلمنا في الوحده ديت ريبورت نيوز اباوت ريليشن شيبس كونفرسيشنز اباوت ات ديسكرايب اكستندد فاميليز برضه كونفرسيشنز واكسبريشنز كلها موجوده وكلها يعني لازم تسمعها كتير جدا عشان تستخدمها في كلامك compare people discuss family cultural traditions وخدنا مقال او طبعا uh, paragraph reading عليها ف it's very important في كده يعني listening is very important listening the key to better speaking okay so practice makes progress ف it's very very important to listen every single day okay اما حاجة اللي انت تسمع كتير جدا للغة الانجليزية كل يوم alright so uh, I think that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching. Alright, for the man to try your time in life we uh, follow the page on Facebook عشان uh طبعا توصل لك كل جديد ووصل لك كل لايف بيتعمل على الصفحه ان شاء الله وتشير مع غيرك عشان كل يستفيد. So thank you.